All right, I'm crying, Uncle. I got up here and then I realized I still have to go. Oh, Jesus. Like, I don't even know. I can't see up there, but it just goes on and on. And I, it's about noon. I know I got a good solid four hours of hiking left before I get back to the train station. And I want to, I want to rest a little bit, have a beer and enjoy the, the view and stuff. So I'm bailing out on getting to the peak. I'm not going to get there, but I don't really give a shit because hell, this is awesome. Um, and I'll flip this around. I'm just going to call this my peak. I'm going to say this is the summit for me. Um, pretty damn good. I'm going to let you listen for a second. You can hear the cows from down below in the, in the field down there. So I'm looking, uh, looking over, these are the, well, the Alps are all along here going from, let's see, I think I'm going from east. Yeah, I'm going from east, east to west across, um, and, uh, around the bend around here would be the, the Zugspitz which is Germany's tallest peak. And then of course you keep going and you're into Austria. Um, but whew, I, like I said, I underestimated this hike. I was with uh, quite a lot of people my age and older, um, like seventies, maybe even eighties, hiking, scrambling up this mountain. These German folks, man, they're in good shape. Um, but I got to a crossroads and there were a whole bunch of people and I figured out, I talked to somebody and I figured out, okay, I'm going this way because I wanted to go to the peak. And I didn't know what everybody else was doing. I carried on. And as I kept going and going and going, I noticed there were, there was nobody behind me. Um, so I think that was the spot at which a lot of people just turn around come up the chairlift, get to that spot, beautiful spot, kind of a high peak, turn around, probably stop at the, at the restaurant where the chairlift drops you off, and that's probably a good day for a lot of people. And Maybe that would have been wise for me to have made that decision, but no, I'm glad. I got time, just got to figure out where I'm at, where I'm going, and uh, got to scramble back down that freaking boulder now. Uh, it's probably going to be harder than, than it was getting up. All right, that's it.